Want to use WhatsApp Business with multiple users? This video breaks it all down for you. There are two types of WhatsApp Business accounts, the WhatsApp Business app and the WhatsApp Business API. Choosing the best option depends on how big your team is and how complex your messaging needs are. And if you're wondering whether you can use both at once, stick around, we'll cover that too. The WhatsApp Business app is ideal for small businesses that want to manage customer chats from a few devices. It lets you use WhatsApp on one phone and link it up to four additional devices using WhatsApp Web or the desktop app. You can also get basic tools like quick replies, labels, and auto responses for welcome and away messages. Now that you know the benefits, here's how to set it up. On your WhatsApp Business app, tap the More Options icon if you're on Android or go to Settings on iPhone. Next, tap Link Devices and select Link a Device. On your additional device, open WhatsApp Web or the WhatsApp Desktop app. Scan the QR code shown on the screen using your main phone. Once linked, your team can start using WhatsApp Business across multiple devices. No need to keep your phone online. But what if you have a larger team or need better workflows? That's when the WhatsApp Business app falls short. For some serious teamwork, you will want the WhatsApp API. Unlike the app, the WhatsApp API is built for scale. You can support a limited number of users, however, it doesn't come with its own interface. You'll need to connect it to a conversation management platform to handle messages and calls, and depending on the platform, you can have advanced automation and AI capabilities, perfect for companies that handle marketing, sales, and support over WhatsApp at scale. For a reliable and secure WhatsApp business solution provider, consider Respond.io. You can get started with a free trial with up to 10 users, then choose a plan that fits your business. Let's walk through how to add multiple users to your WhatsApp API setup using Respond.io. First, make sure you've got your WhatsApp API account ready and you're signed up on Respond.io. Need help setting that up? Check out the video linked here. In your Respond.io dashboard, go to Settings, Workspace Settings, Users, Click Add User to invite teammates by entering their email addresses. Assign them to a user role based on the access you want them to have. Next, create teams to organize agents and manage visibility once they join. From there, you can assign chats to specific agents, leave internal comments, use tags to organize conversations more efficiently. Here's something many businesses ask. Can I use the WhatsApp Business app and the API at the same time with the same phone number? Normally, no. You would have to use one or the other depending on your platform of choice. Luckily, one of the benefits of using Respond.io is that you can use both at the same time with the same phone number. It's the best way to try out WhatsApp API without overhauling your current work operations. That means your team can continue using the WhatsApp Business app for day-to-day -day messaging and calls, and use API-powered features on Respond.io like more user access, advanced automations, and agent monitoring, all this while using the same number. If you find that WhatsApp API is not suitable for your business, this is completely reversible, no harm done. But if WhatsApp API is the right fit for your growing business, you can fully migrate to it and upgrade to a more suitable plan on Respond.io. We'll help you connect everything, guide you through setting up, and improve your customer conversations. Click the link below to get started, and if you have any questions, leave them below. Don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe, and as always, keep the conversation going on Respond.io.